Hello, my name is Sally and I'm from Natural Spa Supplies and I'd like to introduce you to the art of natural toothbrushing using toothbrushes that come directly from trees. So we've got two types, um, we've got the olive tree sticks and then we've got the Mizrak roots and you can see immediately they're easy to distinguish from each other. The olive stick is brown, they tend to be thinner and when you start to use them you'll find the fibres um, are much softer and you'll find them very easy to start off with. Um, so th that's kind of a good recommendation if you are brand new um, to brushing with tree sticks. And then you've got the Mizwak and the sort of the main characteristic of the Mizwak is it has a very, <laughs> very strong a kind of um, smell and taste, kind of horseradishy, mustardy but it is clinically proven to do um, wonders um, for the teeth and for the oral hygiene. And if you're curious to try both, we actually sell two at once if you want to try both like that. At Natural Spa Supplies, we were the first to offer these toothbrush sticks in plastic free packaging. Um, so we're going to send them out to you in a greased food paper bag. <laughs> Um, if you want, you can then transfer them to a jar. So you might be wondering how you transform this stick into a toothbrush. Well, it's very easy. Just put it in the mouth and start moving it around. So just move it around the teeth, um, chew on it a little bit, and before you know it, the bristles on the end will form. So you can see already, just after a few minutes, that the end is actually forming bristles. And that means I can now clean the teeth and I can clean along the gum line. And with a little practice, you'll be able to reach every surface of every tooth and every piece of gum line. So I'm going to use this stick um, for a little while until the bristles are about half a centimetre long and then I'm going to trim the stick and it means that next time I start using the stick I'll be starting with a firm head and as I work um, the stick in the mouth the bristles um, will soften up and that's when I can do the gums. Um, so yeah, this is how these um, toothbrush sticks work. The great thing about using these toothbrush sticks is that you can actually feel and hear areas on individual teeth that need more attention because where there's a plaque build-up or a tartar build-up, it will sound and feel different. So you can work on those areas until all the teeth feel and sound totally clean. So when the bristles get a little bit too long or when you'll finish that toothbrushing session, you'll need to trim the bristles. Um, for most of the sticks, a pair of household scissors is absolutely um, more than adequate. Um, but for the thicker Mizwax, um, it's best just to use a pair of secretaires. You do not need to buy a special Mizwak trimming tool. Secretaires are more multi-purpose. You can just um, literally trim the bristles back, uh, but what I'm going to do is um, create like a tapered head. So I'm going to trim on this side first, trim on this side, and then I've got a little kind of pointed um, area. So next time I start brushing my teeth, that's going to go in between the teeth where I tend to get um, a plaque build up at the front. So just carry on using the stick, trimming the stick. Um, you can wash it in between uses as well. And keep going until it's too tiny to use. These sticks are suitable for everyone to use. And even if you have very sensitive teeth, I would urge you to try them. It's a great time to try these if you're going camping or caravanning or to a festival or on a long journey. And um, I'd love to hear how you get along with them. Put your questions and your comments down below. And thanks for watching. Do subscribe and I'll see you again next time.